or seatbacks. I don't want Okay, to here we are at the button. San Diego Zoo. It is right side, uh, July 2nd, 2009. It's now part of the lower and section. And we are on the uh, San Diego Zoo tour bus. Kind of right and in we the are, are of circling zoo. around the zoo the, to uh, uh, tiger enclosure come up on you the know, get a fairly in a get a few of all the animal exhibits. So you can tell since we do have a lot of new walk through exhibits. Here is the tour for you. We have a second bus for you guys called the Express. That's one you can hop on up off at the different stops around the zoo. Over to your right you'll see about half of the tiger exhibit. I don't see a tiger right now but I'll pass by slowly just just in case. Keep in mind it's that time of day. The cats like to sleep usually from late morning to late afternoon. But the uh, good news is that we're now open till 9 o'clock so around sunset would be a better time for the cats. Now that we at the uh, lower portion of the Lost Forest. Area to your right side used to be called Hippo Beach when it first opened. Uh, we then called it the Aturi Forest for a while. Now it's part of the Lost Forest. Lost Forest has both the hippos and the okapis. Look for the okapi first in the background behind the hippo pool. Okapis look a little bit like a zebra with their stripes. It's actually a much closer relative to the giraffe. The only found in Central Africa, only found in the rainforest. As for the hippopotamus, he's most likely underwater at the moment. Hippos dehydrate very quickly. They'll spend most of their daytime hours underwater. What I want you to do then, Ron, is get beneath this shelter so you can see Otis, the hippopotamus, gliding underwater. Otis is our new male hippopotamus, just moved down from the Los Angeles Zoo. The keepers uh, nicknamed Otis the Wild Man. He was a wild-caught hippopotamus back in 1976. Once you leave the hippos, you're almost at the uh, very bottom end of the Lost Forest. This area will have monkeys, otters, forest buffalo, lots of birds, all from Central Africa. You might see some of those monkeys come up on the right-hand side. We have both uh, swamp monkeys and the spot-nosed monkey. Check the uh, lower branches. Check the new tree houses. You might see some of these monkeys. Spot-nosed monkey will be a little bit bigger. Spot nose monk of course, a white spot on the nose. You can also call them uh, guanins. Guanins are uh, typical African primate. 